Hi, I'm Matt with Cinerama. Imagine working long and hard on a school project and now you have no way to display it. Well, that shouldn't be a problem because Cinerama's got the perfect product for you. It's called the Cinerama Project Base and Backdrop. Now, that's what you see here. This one here is a large. You can also get it in a small. And with that, you're going to have a very durable base that you can actually put your project on. You'll have labels that you can actually custom label your project. And with that as well, you'll also have a very generous size backdrop that you can custom make any way you want it to fit your project. Now that project we talked about, you put a lot of time into, let's say you want a simple display for it. No problem. You simply cut off a few pieces of your backdrop. You can take those scraps, make it into an easel so you can actually set your project right on top of it. It's going to give you a very clean look to it and hopefully you'll bring home that great grade you're looking for. And that's pretty much what we've done here. Very simple, very clean, and very effective for your project. So let's say we wanted to take that one step further and actually build your project right on top of the base itself. You simply start by putting the backdrop into the base, it fits real snug into the slot for it, and then simply build your project right on top of it. It's a nice strong base, so don't be afraid to build a nice project on it. And that's pretty much what I've done here by using some of the extra uh, backdrop material. I've made a divider on it, put some landscaping in there, and this project's pretty much ready to go. Now as the backdrop goes, you can simply paint it however you want it. You can actually cut it out like I've done here and made that uh, part of my project itself. It adds a lot of interest to it and really keeps your attention on the project. And speaking of painting, you can go as far as you want with painting. You can actually paint a nice sunset like I've done here. You can paint some trees on there, some landscape. It just gives a lot of depth to the project and a lot of interest. And that's what people like to see when they look at any type of diorama or a school project. And same goes as here. This one here is one of my favorites. It's got a lot of interest to it. We've actually added a lot of dimension to it, almost a 3D effect by taking that backdrop and then incorporating that right into the project as well. Tons of detail, a lot of little interesting things to look at, and this one's definitely going to pull a good grade. Now in case you're wondering, all these projects here are made out of 100% Cinerama product. They make it very simple to make this level of diorama. Now in this diorama here, I've actually taken a step further and I've even labeled all my items you see in the diorama. I've taken again some leftover backdrop, cut those into strips, put my information on there and then place those on a diorama. Same thing with the one down here. I actually take some photos off the internet or you could possibly clip some photos out of a magazine, glue those to remaining backdrop and then put those into place. It just adds a lot of information to the diorama and helps that viewer understand what it is they're looking at. It's really gonna help that grade climb up the ladder. Now another great way I like to use the base would be to actually build a project on the inside of the base itself. It's got a lot of room in there and it's a very durable base, so definitely take advantage of building on the inside of it. On this small base here, I've actually made a small shadow box. I've used the actual backdrop, painted it black to match the base, and then simply built some shelving in there to uh, display this collection. You could also build a show box or any other type of project that would actually house itself on the inside of the base. A few other great ways to use your project base would be to simply use it for a transport. It's got a lot of room inside of it. You could put all your arts and crafts in there or possibly all your model materials. Or even if you have a messy project, you know, you need to display it at the science fair. For example, a water diorama or possibly even an erupting volcano. Let that base be the catch-all for all the mess. You could easily wipe it out, clean it, and use it over and over again. So the next time you're planning a school project, definitely take the time to pick up a Cinerama Project Basin Backdrop. You can find one at your local hobby shop or order one online at Cinerama.com.